Yo, be quonky here. Things look set up. Getting ready to do a very special stream tonight. Before we get started, I always like to say the best way to support me in the channel is to like, comment, and subscribe. YouTube, Twitter, Twitch are the three main ones. These gaming streams do upload to do VODs on YouTube as well as other uploads like shorter form Let's Plays and commentary, uh, whatever stuff. Uh, and uh, Twitter, I like to retweet fun stuff or tweet whatever. Um, and updates when I go live. So I do appreciate all the support. So if you're watching this now, whether it be on the VOD, follow, follow, subscribe, all that. I command you. Or whatever. No big deal. But today I wanted to play the Genesis version of The Little Mermaid. I'm also kind of curious as to see how this will perform. Maybe more so the VOD on YouTube, since that's more of my following, I would say. So this came with, with the remake just around the corner, just to see which I don't have no plans to see the remake. Uh, I don't think I've seen any remakes by the live action remakes, at least by Disney. I only think maybe the first uh, Jungle Book, because like, they remade that. I'm not sure if that was Disney, just because I don't know if the Jungle Book is technically uh, a Disney property. That's like an original story. Um, I just remember, I think it had the guy who actually played Liu Kang in the, Mortal Kombat movies, or maybe not. I can't, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, and I remember having fun with this game. I feel like this, I'm not sure if it's underrated. I was test playing it, and it's, it's okay. I don't want when people think of old school, um, like 90s Disney games, they think of The Lion King and Aladdin, which might be fun to visit on the uh, uh, channel, whether it be on Twitch or YouTube. Probably both, probably a stream, but let me know. Uh, any feedback would be awesome. But let's get things booted up. Uh, yeah. Okay. And here we go. And the only thing with the beginning of this game, you have to wait for this to uh, go. Although it kind of like jumped to it, so it says like who it's developed by. I also get to hear that metallic sound of the Sega music. So I'm gonna start. Before I do, I'm gonna uh, crack open a my beverage. Ah, nice pop on the mic. I'm just drinking a uh, twisted tea, the half and half. Okay, that looks easy. But what I'm going to do, I'm not going to be Ariel, I'm going to be Triton. And pretty simple, pretty much you just have to go around the level looking for, uh, I don't know what you call them, like the uh, tiny um, uh, creatures that the mermaids get changed into. So, let's get going. Uh, if you get the basic attack and you have like a powerful attack too, which have 20, then have five keys, and then you can summon fish friends. Also, when you pause, this map is helpful because it tells you like where to find all these little creatures you have to help, and you can select what's um, friend. Sebastian is kind of the more useful one because he attacks enemies. Flander pushes rocks. And the fish with the nose, which I never seen before, is uh, he digs up um, little sand traps where you can get treasure. Oh yeah, that's good treasure from the. Did the clams always drop that? I was testing this earlier, and. I forget the seagull's name, but you can use your treasure to buy stuff. Um, I'll buy extra lives. This is trying to attack. You can get health. Let me buy some extra Sebastians. Oh, yeah, you have to unpause. So save someone else. Let me see. I just want to make sure I'm not missing you one. Okay, so I want to go top and the top left. Okay, so I was missing some people. I think once you save everyone in level, it goes to a boss fight, surprisingly. Mm 
Okay. You see. I think you can get him without. There you go. Because you could use uh, Flander to push that block, but you can kind of cheat it with his attack. Okay, this one down here. I think there's kind of. A lot of Disney music sounds. blend kind of. I don't know if they had the same composer or not, because I was. I might play Tailspin. I was uh, playing around with the. Oh. Oh. I should bat. I shouldn't get him. Okay. Then let me make sure. Okay, good. So I can kind of move forward. I would like to find a chest because that's where you get a good amount of your health pickups. Is from the treasure chest. I hate these little urchins, but let's see. I think this is a chest. Here we go. There we go. I wanted the heart. Wait, be careful. I'm not. I just want to make sure I'm not passing that one creature. Okay, I can go down and around. Because there's three to get. I think maybe the difficulty ch changes how much you have to collect. Or find. Okay, there's this guy. It looks like, just like Ariel. But I think I've seen that sprite a few times. Oh, and then let's get this chest. Not too much treasure, but got the health, which I wanted. Uh, I can use Flutter to push that, but let me just shove that off, so. I do like Sebastian, but if you're familiar, he can do this. Okay. Getting all these eels. Got treasure. And then here's the last one. There's like four aerials just flying out of there. And I think you just have to wait. There you go. And then it's the first boss fight. This guy, which I have no idea who he's supposed to be. Oh. Just zap him. This kind of reminds me of Sonic Spin Ball with the music. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Got him. More mermaids just explode everywhere. And now I think there's five levels, so let's see if we beat this on stream. Okay, cool. We got full health. That's good. Oh, gotta get that guy. Cause you had this closed off uh, ship area and then you go to the other parts of the level. I think that map can be a little annoying because uh, it takes so time of animation to whenever you want to... Oh! That still hurts you when you... I think your attack also saves them or whatever. Wait, let me get Sebastian out. He might be helpful to get these skeletons, so let's see. Okay, you got two over there. Okay. But right, we'll... Because these skeletons are just... How they are, they can do damage with their remains. Okay, so there was two... Okay. But then a cannonball fire fires at you. Uh. Wait, can he? Uh. Okay, I'm gonna get flounder. Okay, so the skeleton takes some time to uh, despawn. 
But I want to get that treasure because that probably has some um, healing. Fella, come on. Okay. Oh, that's a good amount of health. Okay, cool. That was definitely worth it. Oh, urchins are coming out of that. And skeletons will just keep on going. Imagine the Kingdom Hearts level <laughs> like this. The, um... Uh, little Mary Pot. Oh, okay, this guy up here. Okay. Okay, so I think you gotta go up this way. Oh, another key. Let's see. You got a pearl. And pearl! Okay, uh, and... Oh, watch out for that. Ah. Okay, so I think we have all those. Okay, that's 14. So this four, and then all of them are on the second ship on the other side. Oh, okay, dodge the cannon. So, one... Oh, the sharks is a kind of tougher enemy. Let me get Sebastian here. Swinging Disco. Okay. Okay, and then I can go to the second ship. I kind of wish I knew where the shop was. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. I'm gonna get a small health. An extra life. And two Sebastians. Okay, there we go. Make sure I got those saved. Okay, then we just gotta get to the ship somehow. Just flying around, saving these. Okay. So I definitely need Flounder for here. Hmm. I'm also not sure if you can get shit out of luck, because I know you can waste the fish calls. Maybe you can use the clams to um, uh, farm treasure. Okay. Okay. This Okay. Oh, we've got a bunch of them here, so... Oh, yeah, his uh, regular attack can recover them. So, this... Okay, there's one down here. There's one thing I like uh, when I was playing around with this, is that when you lose your health, instead of, like, dying and a kill animation it just resume it just recovers your uh, health and takes away a life without really like disrupting gameplay so that's kind of a cool thing oh there's a shop here but it's kind of a weird spot I can't really get to it maybe on this side okay okay I'm gonna get a little bit of health even I might find something in I'll get extra Flanders. Not Flanders. Uh, uh, flounder. Flat Flounder. Keeping over my words. I like, yeah, in the remake, that's probably the worst thing visually about it is how they redid uh, Flounder. Okay, cool. We saved them all. Okay, and then what's the boss fight here? Oh, the shark! And he spits out other sharks. Wait, can I... Oh, that's funny, he has the map, but let's get Sebastian here. He might help. Kind of weird how they have the red animation. Oh wait, there's different spots that he's like... Oh, he did waste all the super attack. Oh my God. Okay. 
Okay, see that, that I lost a life, so that's how what it, this game does. Oh wait, I did beat him. There we go. The shark had all those mermaids. Level three. Okay, how short is this game? <laughs> okay, I can't... I was trying to see if I can use my trident to save him that way. Oh, but there's only seven, so this shouldn't be too bad. I'm just going to explore before I pull up the map. Dude. Mm. Try... Yeah, these little urchins... Okay. What I want to do, let's get... Oh, I'll look at the map. Okay, that's strange. You seem to be in the same... On the left side. I want to use this guy. I guess I can I can use some treasure. I wonder if he's going to dig through both of those. Okay, he only does one. Lazy. Okay. Okay, we have three for Sebastians. Okay. Hello, statue. Oh, did I destroy it? I wonder if I should buy uh, this extra special tax, a little trident beam. I forget what Ariel's is. Um, but I don't know, maybe if we have time, we'll just kind of play through the best around with the game again as Ariel. Okay, that one didn't have health, but not that I'm suffering too much. Okay, there's one over there. So let's get that little friend. Oh. Oh. Diamond! Okay. Wow. Sucking chest and it barely has anything. Okay. Oh, there's one over there I almost missed, too. Maybe if you, yeah, it must be on, on harder difficulties. There's like more crazy placements or whatever. I'm not sure if it's like damage as well or enemy placement. Although it seemed like there was a lot of these guys I had to find on the previous level, like the sunken ship. Okay. Ooh, oh, getting a lot of keys though. And that statue just jumped down. Okay, let's look at the map. Okay, I have to go way back to the left. Okay. Hmm. Ah, I'm hit by these discus. <laughs> oh, what? Wow, did she just do that so much crap time damage? Okay, there's one down here. Ariel again. Okay, there's one up there. And then where's that last one? Okay. okay, down. Oh, okay, down to the right. Okay. Okay, I'm not sure where I. This level design seems so small compared to the other ones. Okay, so let's make a wing. Oh. Okay, let's not take damage because I think the health is gonna regenerate at the boss fight. And who would he have? This statue. Oh! This seems familiar because I remember beating this game, so I think this one. Oh, never mind. Yeah, it does seem familiar, but I thought it was going to be, uh, what you want to call this, like the statues. I'm not sure if I'm hitting in the right spot. Oh. Can we just... Okay, they have like the 
Oh wait, okay, yeah. Definitely going down. They just, I think, just attack the snakes. This, this one doesn't have, seem to have bad, as bad of attack patterns, but I just don't feel like I'm doing much. Okay, maybe not the like the Medusa head. Although it has a blinking eye, which is kind of creepy. Maybe shoot downwards. Okay, I feel like I got more hits in doing this. Okay, there we go. And just like that. Level 4, the cave. Now that's kind of a fun song. Okay, let me get Sebastian here. Okay, there's a lot more. To 18. Okay, so go down. And, okay, let me go up and down and all around. Oh wait, I wanted to get Sebastian too. I had to wait for that too. And okay. okay, we have plenty of lives, and we also get continues too. So I think this game is very forgiving or very casual. I don't know what you call it. We need a dumb kid and uh, games are easy. Okay, I mean, those pearls are worth a lot. Okay. Okay, there's a chest. Okay, I can use a little health. Come on. Okay, just a little health. Okay, I'm gonna just try to find as much as I can without. Oh. Without constantly turning on the map. Let's get this. Come on. Okay, get a little damage. I thought I was like getting lucky with the lava. Hmm. Hmm. Swimming around. Okay. Like maybe I should. I'm oh, gonna just pull up the map and I think Flounder is gonna help here. Okay, I might. Oh shit. Whole reason I paused. Come on. Go. Oh. I just <laughs> passed through it anyways. Okay. Well, thanks for your help anyways, Flanlier. I hate these urchins. Okay. It seems like we're having a good time. We, even though there's like lava and electric eels and sharks and having some good music okay there's okay, okay that seems good you can buy keys but I'm, I'm drowning in keys okay oh get this guy down here Hey Ariel, the tenth Ariel I've seen. All my daughters look the same. Oh, that beetle! I forgot. I didn't even mention that little crazy beetle. I don't know if he can like destroy them. Like, travels pretty fast for being underwater. 
These blocks don't really do much. Just get in the way. Although I'm sure Flander can kind of move them around for ease, but... Oh, there's Ariel again. I'll probably just switch to Ariel and do another playthrough if this uh, wraps up pretty quickly. I'm not sure if you see that Ariel sprite when you're Ariel. Or if Ariel just keeps turning into a small little creature thingy. I'm not sure what you call them because they're not really an, e an eel. I don't know, this really creepy thing that Ursula turns uh, mermaids to. Ooh. Come on. Oh, you got a lot of good treasure. Okay, I can... Oh, so with some of these blocks, it feels like I can get around with not using Flander to move them. Oh. Any pearl. Ooh! Wait, another item shop. How much treasure do I have? Not much. I'll save it. I, mean, I could probably stock up on that special tack, but I'm good without it. I only died once. Wait, these... Okay, Flander, move these now. There you go. Yeah, electric eel. I'm not sure if that is doing the most damage. There's Ariel again. It's gonna attack. Okay, got some treasure. Oh, got two more. I saw the other one up here, so didn't need to rely on the map too much. So let's hang tight. We'll get full health and go to the boss fight. Okay, what did we? What are we dealing with? Oh, Ursula. Is this thing this short? Maybe because I did the easy mode. I'm just gonna. Feels like if I attack from the top, <laughs> a little beam attack is being a little annoying. I guess like. I wish it could kind of be more clear that I'm doing damage. Okay, I feel like this is right. So I was worried if you had to make your beams attack her. Like, attack her with her own attack, but it doesn't seem like they do anything. Okay, oh, there she goes. She ain't herself. How embarrassing. I said, you're the real Ariel. She does look different. Oh! Defeated Ursula. And that's it. <laughs> and that's the stream. Thanks for watching. Okay, now I can press pause. Let me, I'm going to be Ariel. I'm just going to do medium difficulty and see how that changes. Cause I thought there would be more levels because I think we did four because we did the reef, we did the ship, we did the marble statues and the kind of level. So in a cave. So I'll do one more playthrough. This is a little bonus. There she is, the beautiful babe. Okay, so she shoots these notes. Then her special attack is like a star. Let's just see it. Okay. Okay, I felt like the first stage also had 11. I thought that's gonna. That might be a little annoying, but oh well. I feel like she swims better than Triton. I gotta look and see if there's any of these mermaids that look like. Ariel. Ugh. Yeah, this, this. 
Okay, I think it, they don't give it the red hair. Okay, how much? No, I don't think I have much treasure. No. I'm probably just going to save up for lives just in case. Although, I'm, I think I could... Oh, okay, yeah, they changed that sprite to have brown hair. Which I, that's kind of interesting. Because when you try it, it's a red hair one, but it's not Ariel because you see Ariel at the end of the game. Make sure I'm not missing anyone to the left. Okay, we're making good progress. Yeah, I feel like she controls a lot better than uh, King Triton. Look at... yeah. Let's see... And it didn't... And it didn't feel like Triton was like stronger or more powerful in terms of like attack and damage, but... Chests are always different. I feel like maybe it could be a difficulty. Look, this one has more to it. Oh, let me get that. The beetle. I don't think you can do. I don't. Know, I haven't killed them, but I don't want to waste my energy. Oh, in the pearl. Let's see. What? Oh, okay, good. And now there's an X. I think maybe that's the difficulty is that you have to reach the uh, end of the stage versus um, when you're playing on easy. I think you just have to wait a few seconds. It'll take you to the boss. So we'll see how different this mode is. Okay, this one. And then I think the last one's down here. Okay, so they all fly away. Okay, so it's not any of the stage. Let me see. It's had the X. Yeah, I was just right there. What? I just go down here. Okay. Oh. I think his her special attack, which I wasted, seems to go in like one or two directions versus Triton was just like a beam. I'm not sure if this guy just has extra hits or... Come on. Come on. Okay, got him. Yay, let's swim up. Now we're in the sunken ships. Yeah, but definitely Ariel and uh, feels a lot different from King, King Titan. The Triton. Did I say Titan? The Titan King. <sighs> no, oh, yeah, I should get keys as I find them. Oh, of course, there's one guy up here. Oh. 
Oh, that's right, there was a treasure chest that I should get. Wait. Okay. Call. Oh, that he just jumped up. That skeleton. Hopefully. Oh no. And I'm not sure if it's the difficulty, but uh, last time it, that gave me a lot of good health. Okay, so go down there. Okay, and then there's the exit. Okay, so I think since it's a more difficult, you actually have to reach an uh, exit. Oh, oh. You try to get out of here. I'm just gonna try to beeline it to the shop so I can. Let's see. Oh crap! Nope. I lost a life, but oh well. Okay, where's the. This guy. Let's make sure I'm not missing on the left side's good. Okay, got two in between. Okay. This guy. And there's one over here. Or. There he is. Then we gotta go to the second ship. Oh, I'll take this key. Okay, th so that's that. Let's see, can I buy some lives? Okay, buy one. Oh. Yep. So. Oh, then we need. How many Flanders do I have? Because. I think this is the only time where you actually need them, need them, but okay. I should buy two more Flanders and maybe an extra life. I wonder if you can soft lock the game if you don't have Flander. Yeah, you don't get the red-headed mermaid when you're Ariel. She, they, they make a brunette. Even though that is not technically Ariel if she's at the end of the game. But I think we're going to see King Triton at the end of the game. Oh, this game is kind of nostalgic because I do remember for some reason having it. Even though I wasn't too big of a fan of... I think just because the little memory feels like more of a girl movie than the boy movie. But you know, to each their own. Um, I think just with like that Disney, like usually it was like Lion King or Aladdin that was played on VHS. I think maybe having a sister too, uh, you know, siblings, uh, they kind of influence what we watched. Careful. Okay, how do I get to that one again? Oh, I don't have no treasure. Maybe just buy two of these. Okay, make sure, because you have to unpause to leave the store. Because if you don't. Oh. oh crap, I probably. The her attack is a little bit more annoying. Wait, does this shop leave? Okay, we got the treasure. Come on, health. Give me health. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Okay. Oh. oh I can't go up there. Oh, 
does rocks just respawn? I'm not sure because I went to the shop. I forget the pelican's name. Did it? Or a seagull, that's it. I think it's a seagull. Is it a seagull or a pelican? No, no, not a pelican. It has to be a seagull. But I'm not sure what. I think they have them in a remake. Oh, not a rocks are gone. I have more treasure, but maybe because I spent it on the flounder. Okay, so we go down here. I think... I think I can just spam the attack. Oh, there's so many sharks. Okay, we killed them. There you go. Okay, so we beat that one without losing a life. Okay, Atlantis. Okay, that's the statue place. So the Atlantis and Cape. I've... Maybe there's one more boss. I thought there was five stages. When I was kind of like looking up stuff online. Let me make sure. Okay, that's why this level. So you save these ones and just beeline it to the end of the level. Okay. I hate those urchins, but it feels like they don't do as much damage. We'll see. We're gonna save daddy and Let me make sure. Is there one over there? Yeah, I want to get that one first. Let's just keep on going. Okay, this treasure. Not that I need the health, but I would like to get extra light. Oh, okay. yeah. Was that the same one from earlier when I played this level as Triton? Okay, those discs, it's kind of like fly around. Maybe I should... Okay. Okay, this one has more treasure. Ugh. Okay, that was just a hundred, but... but wait, let's get this guy over here. Or it's my imposter. Yep. Okay. Let's see. Where's the other two? Oh, I passed them. Okay, good thing I checked. Let's wrap around, save those two, and then beeline it for the exit. Oop. That sound effects. Oh. You know what? That's probably why you can turn off sound uh, in the options. Oh, that's kind of interesting when you start the game, it has the options. Um, and then you start. Okay, so let's make a way to the exit. Yep. Uh. Well, that is a lot easier uh, not to worry about finding the exit on the easy mode. Although I'm pretty sure that's because we chose the easy, not that we chose uh, King Triton. I thought I probably could use the fish to dig for treasure, but... I think we're doing pretty good. <sighs> Shoot. Okay, I think we're almost at the exit because... Oh, can we afford a... I'll just take an extra life. I 
don't think I need to worry. I haven't been using Sebastian's. Okay. Okay. Boss fight. Now it's a snake lady. Can you, can you kill this guy? Okay, yes. I feel like if I when I did attack from above that did a lot more damage. Although you have these fire uh, I'm just not sure of the hitbox. Ah. I feel like the, uh, from above worked better. I feel like she slightly moves for down without my control. Okay. Okay, then we got this guy. God, God, he's just shooting lava everywhere. Come on. Is this working? I'm not sure. Come on. Okay, he's not shooting straight up, but I want to beat him without losing a life. Yes! Oh! Took damage from the snake's body, but... Okay, too good. Okay, we're at the cave. So I'm not sure if there's a additional level. Okay. But it still has very, a, a scary cave. It does have pretty fun music. Okay, but I think in terms of the creatures, the mermaids we have to rescue, I feel like that's the same placement, the same number. That hasn't changed. There's one chest. Get a little bit of treasure. Okay. Oh, and. Okay. Get some key. Let me just check. Okay, so we go up. Okay, we have these two up here that we need to save. Got you. And then you up there. Okay, I think it'll be Ursula on three lives, but I think we might be able to afford an extra one. Let's see. I need to get past. Yeah, I do. Because that means it seems. Okay, I'll Flander. Push that rock. Come on. I'm gonna sit there like an idiot. Cause I felt like I was able to get past that last time before Flanders started moving it, but okay. I don't think there's any down here. Okay, no, I wanna go up. Okay. There might be some treasure, but let's just focus on Saving these creatures. Oh, the mermaids. My brethren and sister my bro brothers and sisters. Let's see, any down here. Okay, so we go up. Okay, let's get these next five. This one. I don't think we need keys much, but oh. not much treasure. Okay, I'll just take a tiny bit of health. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to afford an extra life. Wait, this guy down here. Yeah, I should be able to beat Ursula. If not, I should have con uh, one continue when you do normal mode. Oh, 
still shock you? Okay, is it one up here before I make the check? Okay, that's the next area. So let's go down to left and save the other two. I'll come back for that treasure just in case it has a good uh, recovery. I forgot the name of the eels. I haven't seen what they look like in the remake. Although I'm sure they're in trailers, I just didn't pay attention. But Jetson and Bletson or something? I don't know. Okay, we'll just push you here. Come on. Flounder. Do your thing. Flounder. Push it. Thank you. Not so useless after all. As we get, as we get shocked. Okay. Let's see what's down here. Okay, this one. You know what? Can't I have enough? Okay, yeah. I'm just going to recover one more time. I thought there could be another stage. Nope. Come on, let's swim through. Keep on swimming. I thought I should save money out just in case I need more flounders, but I don't think that's going to be the case in this, this one more level that we haven't played yet. For some reason, when I was thinking about this game, I thought there was something with like bubbles or something. But maybe I'm mistaken. I thought we were something with like being underwater and like rainbow bubbles that you have to destroy, like that block the path. I don't know. But I think. Okay, we want to go this way. Wait, no, we don't. Where's that last person? Okay, way down there. Okay. I, I missed this. Okay. So we saved all of them. They're piecing out. And... Oh, crap! got to be careful because I don't want to waste a life just before I get to the boss or the end of the stage. Come on. Okay. There we go. Uh, maybe this is Ursula. Oh, yeah, because there's Triton. Okay, let me just kind of attack from above. I feel like that helped out a lot earlier. This kind of spam attacks. I wish it wouldn't give you constant downward motion with the direction. I'm not sure if it would have helped to have her special attack to do damage, but we're just going to spam musical notes. Cause she didn't take her voice. We don't even have legs. I didn't care. Like, this is not part of the canon of the story. Why would she turn trying that if she hasn't even uh, sold my uh, voice in that contract, whatever? Okay, just. Okay. Oh, good. She's, ha she, Ursula's having a good time. She's shooting lasers. I'm singing to her with my magical voice. Oh, and she inked herself. Oops. And daddy. Nope. Oh. There you go. Yep, we defeated Ursula. And that's it. I'm surprised there's like no game credits or anything like that.
Yeah, I'm not sure if it's worth being on difficult. Let me just see. I'm just gonna look up stuff online and see if there's like any guides. I'm probably not gonna beat the game again, but just for uh, shits and giggles, or poos and ha-has, depending on who you ask. Little. Oh. Okay. I forgot, I have some hotkeys that, uh... Okay. Let's see, walk through. Okay, I guess that's all the levels. I thought there was more, but there's four levels in the bosses. Yeah, so I guess that's pretty much it. Okay, I think also with the difficulty, uh, you get less uh, items to start out with. Like, you don't have uh, special weapons and keys, you have to buy them. You won't continue. A polyp? Is that what they call them? And that the ones that become a mer person, that's a polyp. But yeah, that I'll do it. Let me see how long I've been streaming. Kind of a shorter one. Um, but I didn't realize this game was so short as well. But I, I think that's to do it. I don't want to beat a dead horse, but um, the original uh, Little Mermaid movie, pretty good. Even though, again, not like my favorite in terms of, like I would watch Lion King. Heck I even like to watch Beauty and the Beast for Beast, but I never seen most of those uh live remakes. I think the one in the jungle book. Um let me get just to kill a little bit last bit of time. What was the first jungle book movie? Jungle book movie. Okay, the one in nine is it the one in nineteen ninety four? A Jason Scott Lee was Mowgli. Okay, that's that could weird. He like he played Mowgli, but I think he's like in uh Okay. Maybe he's he's not who I'm thinking about. Let me just double check because I thought he was in uh uh Okay, I guess he wasn't in uh, Mortal Kombat. I'm, okay, I'm confusing him with something else, but um, yeah, he's definitely. Um, okay, okay, he's Hawaiian and Chinese descent, and they had him play Mowgli in the nineteen. Uh, let's see. Let me just see if I can find a little bit more trivia. Okay. Who produced it? Uh, oh, that was Walt Disney. Okay, they did do the first, uh, at least 1994, because I think that one's maybe a little bit better. Although it's been a good while since I've seen it. But they actually did two live remakes. Now it's both Disney, Walt Disney Pictures. But yeah, I think a lot of people um, uh, forget... I think the thing about the 1994 one is that he's like an adult, so I think it's a different take on the story, um, or at least they made more of an age change. I don't know. That, that's going to be a movie worth revisiting. I'm not sure how well. Uh, I think it was received, I guess, looking at it. But yeah, that's enough uh, looking online. And yeah, I think this is a good moment to end the stream. So let me close out the stupid uh, game. Yeah, so I have to say the best way to um, support me in the channel is to like, comment, and subscribe. YouTube, Twitter, Twitch are the three main ones. Catch live streams, all that. Uh, I kind of do follow her, but not, they didn't say anything, so. Um, 
but yeah, I kind of wish uh, the Twitch would be a little bit more active. I feel like some of the, the stream VODs um, on YouTube get some attention um, in terms of like views, but I think I'm just kind of curious is because this is the Little Mermaid and the uh, live action remakes coming out, if that's going to impact anything, but yeah, that will do it. So uh, yeah, you all take care and have a good rest of your day. Goodbye.